Intel, Intel. Damn it, Intel! You guys suck on defense! I did all by myself and I end up dying! He yeah, had spiral. Oh, crap. And now I'm gonna lose my duel because of it! It's over! Someone respawn in our main respawn so I can go into this protected area. I don't want to get killed by some douche bear. <laughs> Never gonna let you down. I'm never gonna run around and desert hurt you. Never, never gonna, gonna say goodbye. goodbye. Never gonna tell a lie and hurt you. Three hundred and seventy-four to one hundred and seventy-six. At one point, it was well over. It was uh, well over five to one. But it's gone down since then. Yeah, I'm that good, Seth. 375 to 176. Uh, spot him. He's good. No, really, it's like five hours. I've been playing since. Today it's uh, Jenny Bach, Jenny Genesee Bach beer. It only comes out in the spring, and it was hard. It's hard to find, and it finally came out today. And I bought two 12 packs. I don't need to scratch it up to a screwdriver. I'm plenty drunk already. Although I also like Evan Williams Cherry Reserve, Admiral Nelson, and Captain Morgan Private Stock. What do you think about the Samuel Adams guy, Captain? Sam Samuel Adams is my favorite beer, aside from what I make myself. Jack Daniels for the loss. That shit is fucked up. And yes, I can't handle the screwdriver. I'm talking to him to kill me! Damn it, Airball! I tried to lie. No, you're not. I tried to light a soldier on fire. things in the past, and you're not sorry at all. I know that. I tried to light a soldier on fire, and he wouldn't light. One cares. Well, why is that? I don't know. Man, we are eat up with spies downstairs. I wrote that. I did not go lightly. <laughs> Jenny Bach was cheap today. Seven fifty for per 12 pack, and it's better tasting than Yingling, okay? That's how awesome it is. That's right, when this menu is still up there. Took long enough to get revenge, bitch tits. Dead ringer spot. Let's I it. don't have... Courtyard, courtyard. Do I have orange juice? Uh, we might have bought an orange juice. I might be able to do a screwdriver. Chelsea would be kind of mad that I'm using the, her orange juice for screwdrivers when I could just be drinking straight whiskey, which I'm going to do. <laughs> She'll understand. Okay, let me finish this uh, sixth and seventh beer. And I won't drink it straight from the bottle, but I will put it in a rock glass with no uh, rocks. <laughs> Chicken and waffles is awesome. But must be, must be I think I'm going to need something else. No, you've never been to a Waffle House, have you? Chicken and waffles? Why the fuck not? The old chop -chop. Oh, man. How about waffles, so, grits, and eggs? Uh, so I was in Bahrain, uh, you know, in 2003 and 2004, which is a small island off the... Uh, coast of Saudi Arabia and my buddy got dumped by his uh, actually he was cheated on and dumped by his girlfriend and he was pretty pissed about it so we got a half gallon of uh, Jack Daniels and I had about two shots and the two other guys drank the other half of the half gallon it was kind of ridiculous then they puked up chicken noodle soup and rice do you know how fucking horrible that is to smell and that's why I left what were you doing there, man? I was supporting my buddy. 
he needed moral support, so I was there, and then I became the sober one, and that no, wasn't no, no, nearly no, no. as fun. How did you get to this island? I mean, what were you doing? Navy. Vacation? Navy. Oh, in the Navy, okay. Yes. My father was on an aircraft carrier for uh, 20 years, flying uh, uh, Orion. Oh, nice. I didn't know Orions have been around for 20 years, but nice. Oh, yeah. Knew they were old, but I didn't know they were that old. Um, yeah, after I left there, I went to a destroyer, USS The Sullivans, named after the five boys who uh, died when right. USS Jude. Yeah, I remember that. World War II history, yeah. I hope you don't remember that. I hope it re was recalled in your history class. Uh, in, in history, yeah, and I, I'm, I study World War II history a lot. Because I uh, don't really hope that anyone who was alive in World War II is playing this game, because I'd feel kind of fucked up. Well, my, my grandmother's first and second husbands were, uh, my, her first husband died at Normandy, and her second husband was in the Pacific Theater, and that was my grandfather. Ah. My grandfather was in Korea, and, and my uh, other one was in the service during Korea, but never actually saw combat. And then I had a great-grandfather who was in World War II, but he's been dead since I was in 8th grade. Don't uh, fucking flag! You're gonna die, yeah. shit bitch. Not gonna remember oh, being a, a little kid. bit too much. See, I told my, you you were gonna die. My grandmother tells me, I got a postcard in the mail telling me my husband had died at Normandy. <laughs> France, what a hell of a place to die. That's right, I'm yeah, dominating you, Arrow. On Utah Beach in, in France. No, I'm not having milk, Yoda. Do you know how horrible that is when you puke that up? What gets me is we had 4,000 people die in one day. In, in France, and, and they bitch when one or two die today. <laughs> it's a different mindset. There was a draft, the whole country is behind it, and nowadays yeah, but, people are just fucking cowards. They're, they no, live in their fucking white castle, and anyone that dies because of war, it's fucking horrible, and they are wrong, but that's my take on it. Of course they're wrong, because if it hadn't have been for us going to war, we would all be speaking Japanese and German right now. I agree. And you wouldn't have any freedom of speech. If you spoke out against anything, they would come kill you. There's a uh, good uh, run of Captain America where the Nazis end up, you know, it's an uh, alternate history where the Nazis end up right, winning, right. and they take over the uh, Empire State's building. And uh, it explains pretty much how the Nazis would run America. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, that would have been a bad mojo. You didn't really think you were going to slide after I hit you with a crit rocket, did you? So who else has built themselves a main cabinet? Oh yeah. Cause that shit is fucking awesome. I love mine. I got a man shop too. No, MAME. M-A-M-E. A what now? MAME. It uh, stands for Multiple Arcade Machine Emulator. Oh, 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 oh. I thought you were. I have yeah, a man's shop as well, it's called my basement, but that's different. Yeah. We got, we got one. I know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah, I got one. I also have torches and plasma cutters, too. <laughs> See, I, I'm not that good. My, the most metal work I can do at my house is use my uh, reciprocating saw to uh, cut a piano hinge. <laughs> <laughs> 